This is Maurice Merleau-Ponty, a philosopher from France who lived from 1908 until 1961. Merleau-Ponty's existentialist theory centered upon perception, or how we see things. He projected the idea that nothing is objective, meaning that nobody can be certain that anything, even a solid object, really exists. Rather, reality consists of an individual's life experiences. For example, if on a daily basis you eat an apple and usually enjoy eating an apple, you likely have positive thoughts when you see one. But, if you once bit into an apple and found a worm, you likely have negative association with the act of eating an apple. Merleau-Ponty extends this idea to everything, not just personal thoughts and feelings. Here's an example of what makes his ideas unique. Meet Rick and Rose. Rick and Rose agree that this chair is red. Merleau-Ponty would point out that while Rick and Rose agree that the chair is red, Rick might actually see the chair as what Rose would consider green. Now Merleau-Ponty has made color subjective. He would also venture to say that the chair itself could actually be an illusion because one can argue that the chair is not present. Like Beth, who disagrees with Rick and Rose, saying the object is actually a cat, that is blue. Technically, Beth is equally accurate in this statement. Making a simple declaratory statement like, the chair is red, is not necessarily factual, but depends upon who is perceiving it. However, given that most individuals would perceive and argue that there is a chair and it is red, this popular reality is the nearest one can get to defining reality. In simpler terms, Rick and Rose are kind of more right in stating that the chair is red, but it is impossible to know for sure.